All right. So argument analysis speech marks uh, are 10, length is three to four minutes. Now these are the this, these are the things that you are supposed to submit to me along with the speech. Full sentence and keyword outline. Now you made another speech uh, previously, you might remember that. For that I asked you to submit to me just the keywords. Okay, but this particular speech, which is called argument analysis speech, for this you are supposed to submit to me basically two outlines. One is the full sentence outline and the other, word, other is keyword outline. We will discuss it more. How will you write it? Okay, at this time you are only understanding the requirements of the assignment. You will also submit to me the Tolman diagram. You know what Tolman diagram is, but what will you write on it? That is what I will explain to you a little more. Hopefully when you did your argument analysis paper, when you wrote it, hopefully you must have, uh, you know, done the Tolman activity for both of the editorials that you are not required to submit that to me with argument analysis paper. But you might recall that while explaining argument analysis paper to you, I told you that your analysis of both of the editorials basically is based on the Tolman tool, right? So if not, uh, you know, really on the paper, at least you might have done, uh, you know, uh, a kind of mental exercise of uh, of applying Tolman method on the editorials that you read. Okay. Anyways, you want, you, you, you have to submit to me the Tolman diagram along with the speech. Okay. Written uh, diagram. You have to complete it, fill it. You have to write what is the claim, what is the evidence and all that. Okay. With reference to that particular editorial on which you are going to speak. And then you also have to submit to me a bibliography. So bibliography basically is a list of resources that you use in order to prepare your speech. I'll, I'll explain more about it later. Okay, so details. In this speech, you will examine the quality of the argument you find in an op-ed. So did you notice uh, this expression, the quality of the argument? This is, this is exactly the same expression we used while understanding argument analysis paper. So the objective of this particular speech is for you to explain in words verbally through a speech to explain the quality of the argument about the op-ed that you are speaking about. So you need to decide on an op-ed to speak about. Now, it can be one from your argument analysis paper. Ask yourself the following questions. Who is the author and what is her affiliation with this subject? Who is the newspaper's readership? What is the big question, controversy, or event being addressed in that particular op-ed? Identify the author's main claim and the evidence he or she does or does not use to support it. And then present the argument in the form of a visual aid using a Tolman diagram. So there would be more explanation about it, but this is the requirement. So these three are the requirements of this particular assignment. Now, this is important. This speech is not an opportunity for you to state your own viewpoint on the topic in question. Okay, don't start telling what you think about that topic. Because you are evaluating the uh, argument of that author, 
you are not giving your argument that will come later the, for for some of the later assignments you will get a chance to give your own uh, position with reference to that particular topic okay that is in fact the last assignment that you have to do later only focus on the quality of the argument all right now this is a checklist that uh, uh, you can you know read through on your own to uh, make sure that you cover most you you kind of meet your speech meet meets the basic requirements uh, this is about the organization how the speech will be organized and this is about delivery okay you already know about uh, how to deliver a speech okay that is something that you are already trained for you made your own speeches previously uh, and then uh, this is about deduction you need to meet the uh, once again you meet you need to meet the requirements and also you need to take care of the time limit okay you you should not exceed the given time limit okay so students this is our next assignment is called argument analysis analysis speech in the next class on thursday uh, i will give you more detailed instructions about that um, probably at this stage uh, you should uh, start thinking about which particular op ed you are going to uh, speak about in this speech so choose the uh, opinion piece or editorial that you would like to speak on also uh, get a print of tolman and then um, uh, start making the diagram i mean by diagram we mean uh, just the you know filling the questionnaire of tolman okay i have shared that sheet with you uh, where um, uh, you know the, the there are questions about the claim and the evidence and the reasons and you know quality of those reasons and evidence and the quality of those evidences and then objections and then rebuttal okay that is called tolman diagram so basically you are supposed to fill that in for the sake of your speech okay so you can start preparing your tolman diagram with reference to that particular uh, op ed that you choose choose to speak on and also start preparing the uh, outline okay full sentence outline and keyword out